the key. One versus of the, any of the Mishima options. Well, it's not only the sidestep speed, but the character's stance and the character's build allows her to laterally move around specifically Devil Jin's tracking moves. So we saw that many times in their last meetings, in their last two meetings. So it's really going to be a question of what Qdans has done to adjust to this. It's yeah. really so so curious. I, 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 I'm I just going to have to sit back and watch like everyone else. Yeah, but I, this is the fun part, though. Yeah. We get to see how they're going to go into this battle. They have a bit more room to play around with. They have the opportunity, you know, the the they might be able to switch characters twice. Of course. You yeah. have two chances to make mistakes but before getting many, locked in. How many times has Qdans played a different character never. outside of... Never. Never. Right? So him just picking another character would be huge. No, it's not him. I'm talking about me. Me, right? So, so yeah. who knows, though? You really think that he's found some tactic that's going to pull the matchup in his favor? Yeah. We'll see. We'll see. I mean, he's had to have done his homework. You can't call out the number one player in the world and say that you don't have anything ready. And you can't show that you nope. don't have anything yeah. ready as there well. There must be something. Why would he do that unless he's got something? All right, looks like he is going straight to Lily. That is what is expected. And the crowd, of course, showing their uh, cheers of approval. Yeah. No weird. No weird curveballs. It's looking good so far. Yeah, and you know what? He has a high success rate in playing sets in tournament. He has lost one set using Lily, but he quickly won the rest of that tournament. Yeah. So Let's see we'll see how this uh, plays table. out. True Tekken gods right here. Yeah, and you know what? These guys are both from the same generation of Tekken play as well. Yes. These guys are legends in their yes. own right. G going back to, you know, the, the original tag and, of course, Tekken 5. These guys have been killers yeah. throughout almost their entire Tekken career. This is it. This is one of the matches that everyone has been waiting for. If you've been following the players, one of the biggest upsets and beatings we've ever seen came from these Lily. I'm at the edge of my seat. Oh, yeah. Here we go. A nice, able to punish there with the tsunami kicks. And, you know, that's the other thing. You know, Lily has a lot of quick and compact pokes that help complement Nii's overall use of movement. Yes. And the sidestepping has begun. Yeah. And broken that's something plate. new I already noticed off the bat. His dash into using the broken plate. Yes. That's something that helps him on the track. Dude, he just sidestepped the rage kick point yeah. blank. Mm -hmm. It's going to happen. He's got to be way more cautious what moves he uses. Because oh, even moves that in your mind should track can be sidestepped by Lily here. Yeah, and we already know the Whoa. God Fist and the Hell Sweep itself, they're a non-factor into the, the way that Nii is facing it. And he's a double gen player himself. He knows how it works. Wow, and look at that first blood from Kudan. I think wow. I think we're trying to see, starting to see yes. what Kudan's counter strategy is. Nice and slow. Is he starting to play the same way, where he's going very compact? Okay, Root of Evil. Oh, oh my god. This is gonna hurt in my kill. Ouch. Oh man, that was brutal. Okay, oh, wow. lightning okay. screw. That's one way to do it. Going back the other way here. He has wall. those uh, sidewall. Ouch. And look at that. Knowing that you have such a huge lead, but you're still gonna duck. Yeah. I mean, when you're trying to make a comeback with DJ, of course, you know, health sweeps are something that's on both players' minds. Oh yeah. Nice job blocking and punishing. Oh. Careful. And again, Plus frames. Quick tracking move. Oh, nice. Harry. Very nice. We're going through this wall. Oh, yeah. And Next we're going wall. to the other wall. Oh, side wall slim, but still able to get some extra added damage. Okay. Low poke. Oh, counter hit. Low parry again. It seems as though Qdans is going to generic low kicks to try and keep her in check with speed, but yeah. man, these low parries are starting to add up. It's definitely not working out, because I mean, Nii not afraid to commit to the low parry opportunity, and that kind of has to think, you know, Kudans has to open it up with Ooh. using other moves, his bids, Flash which are punch. all sidestepable. You're right, that's exactly true. So we're in, oh, max oh. range hell sweep, that's a season two nerf. Okay, and able to get that to connect here, okay. Root of Evil, the follow up here. Backing up in the rear, flash nice. punch combo. All right, he's not out of it yet, but he does have Lily into rage, so he's wow. gonna have to be careful. Man, and that's exactly how you gotta live oh. and die. Oh no! Wow, that could have been so bad, doing the wrong combo to, without the kill there, but he pulls through. This is a huge round, because you want to get out into the lead. You don't want to have oh. that mountain to climb, especially in a longer set. Yeah, don't forget, three out of five here. All right. Heaven's Gate. A able to break it here, the follow up here, gets Hell the health sweep on the Oki. Oh, he ducked. Okay, backing up. And this you notice so here. Tense. Another health sweep. Yeah, good adjustment there. He knew he was max range. 
and he's starting to, you know, change it up here. He's not really using the laser cannon from a further range, knowing that he could sidestep it. Whoa. He's looking good. We're gonna need a miracle from Nii, but he's a miracle worker. Yeah, he got a badge. Be careful. Oh, careful. Backing up. The low oh pump. my gosh, One he's more. using it as well. Oh, oh the hot kick! And is that gonna is that gonna, gonna be it? Oh my god. Is that gonna kill though? I don't know. I don't know. There was a ton of hits before that. I don't know. Oh man, it doesn't kill him. Oh, oh my god. Oh, oh it's a block. Oh my god, what a clutch block at the end. The quick rise, the block, and the punish there with the wall rising oh attack. That was so clutch. Me not pleased with what he saw there. Can you see I mean that whole matchup? That was incredible. It was just back and forth. Yes, so close. It, I can't even call it like who was at the advantage. Yeah. It just came down to that final sequence. That's the way it should be. These are two grandmaster players. Players, former champions, the two best players, former paper, teammates as well. Former teammates. I mean, this is this should be close like that. That's the way it should be. Very nice. And I'm so happy to see that it's with Devil Jin. He's made an adjustment, and it seems to be working. Yeah. This, you know, this might be unprecedented. Are we going to see? I don't want to throw it out there and have him jinx it, but are we going to see a back-to-back -back champion? I don't know. It's, it's very a, possible. It's a little early to tell, but so far. It's yeah. possible. Well, Very the thing is, if you could beat me, I feel like you could beat anyone. It's more possible now than it was before this match started because the last two encounters these two had were just butt ugly for yeah. cute ants. So and, he looks we like, like he's butts adjusted. Too. Yeah, not ugly ones, though. Anyways, going back into it, gets the punish there and the knockdown. That's one of the things that is key in difference between these two players is Lily's Damn. while standing four. You're, you're the, you, you got the French accent. Oh, difference. yeah, you like the difference. The difference. Okay, here we but go. yeah, her wild rising attack can knock down. It is just as fast as well. Oh yes, such a danger. Oh, wow. oh they were thinking the same thing. Both with precise timing. Okay, dashing in the mid, the low, aggressive yeah. pressure. Nia you know, obviously believing in his gameplay style. He knows that Lily is the solution in this matchup. Yes. But the question is, if he loses another one, does he switch? Yeah, it, there's a chance. And, you know, we've seen him play this matchup oh. using several different characters. Yes. And, and look he, at the time. He had great success using other characters like Devil Jin and Paul oh. as well. Oh, Shoot man. Dance. What an impressive adjustment he's made. And patience is a huge factor here when it comes to his adjustment. And, you know, I feel like even though, you know, he just has a round wow. up. In this match, he only has a round up right now. Mm -hmm. But because he has the game differential, he's forcing me to make some yes. some, some choices here. And get second guess his choices. I love this. Okay, plus frames. Knee. Yeah. On the offense, positioning, he's jockeying at the wall. And just seeing how comfortable Kudans is with his back to the wall. Yes. That tells a whole world of difference between how the matchup was compared to the last time when they played. Yeah, I love the way Kudans is waiting, using tsunami kicks, waiting for the right moment to strike, but look how even this is. Oh, yeah. And you know, it's been like that the entire matchup so far. Oh! oh very nice electric out of nowhere. That is a new wow. tactic we have not seen from Kudans in yeah, this matchup or this mm. series. Oh, man. It's, he's using the stutter step, but now mixing it up with an electric. Yeah, his adjustment was timing-based. Yeah. As you can see, it's really paying off. Impressive. And again, it's hard to not think about what a great game this is, because most players would counterpick. Yeah. But there's no need. This is a great game. And the answers are there for you. Yeah. And you know, the way Kudans has always been, his counterpick was just to play better. Mental, yes. It's always just to play better. And the, look at that. He is on the verge of beat. 2-0. Look at this. Against Nii. Nii is the number one points leader right now. He yeah. is considered widely by everyone as the best Man, second player in he, the world. He has truly turned things around. And Nii is now the one at the receiving end of a beatdown. 2-0 in this first to three. No one would have expected this. Is he going back to character select screen? Well, this is really <laughs> where it gets intense. Devil Jin. I think we're going to see DJ versus DJ maybe. Oh my god. Oh man, the I devil would have is never here. guessed that not only is Qdan's going to beat up Lily, Knees Lily, but it's going to be a DJ mirror? I would have never guessed that. And the last time these guys played DJ, they ended up on this stage like four oh times in a row. Oh my god. All right, this is it. Knee. And they it, went through a phase where Knee was a Devil Jin main. Remember that? Yeah. A couple years back during the arcade phase of the Tekken World Tour? Oh, yeah. He was a, main, a Devil Jin main. Anyways, we're going into this matchup. Infinite. Right now, Kudans is up 2-0 here. Yes. This is such a treat.
for Tekken fans all over the world. Very, very Actually, nice. Actually, being in an open stage like this, this is a true test of yes. Mishima skill. It's like tag one. Oh, yeah. And Kudan starting it off real quick there. We had the early launch. Oh, wow. what is he doing? Can Can Raw in the open? Maybe that was supposed to be a Matterhorn. Yeah, might have been. <laughs> Uh -oh. Side step, flash punch combo. Yeah, and again, you're gonna see a lot of this use of the scraper because you know because anti machine attacks are being employed by both of these players. Yes. They're trying to sidestep. They're trying to go towards the opponent's left. We'll see what happens. Keep in mind, Ni is the Devil Jin with the loose yarn hanging off of him. He likes those the tassels, bro. Always picking the same outfit. Okay. Backing up. Me, the first one in lower life. Yeah. Oh my gosh, never mind. Yeah, you Simple. know these guys like to do it. They want to put an exclamation mark on the round victory. Why not? They optimize. Oh yeah. The least amount of button inputs possible. Very round nice. Two. Round one knee. Fight. This obviously is going to need to be a huge adjustment from Kudans. Understandable that it's going to take a moment to go from Lily to Devil Jin. From a defensive perspective, I'm sure he oh, mentally yeah. was all in on beating Knees Lily. And it worked. He got him to switch, but now, still not over you yet. You know, and even though I would say Knees down 0-2, this is where the real battle starts. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's hard to say. I love that he was able to beat his Lily. It just really is so cool. With Devil Jin. Yeah, it shows that he did his homework, man. He believed in his formula, right? Yeah, not only that he did his homework, but the homework was there to do. It's awesome. Oh, ugly lightning screw. Uh -oh. And this is going to hurt. Oh, oh, it's going to hurt if you whip it. It hurt the wrong guy. Oh, my gosh. And look at that. Just like that, we are tied up on rounds. Yes, there's the wake ups. He's running in. Win Godfist. No, he wanted the flash punch for a punish. Yeah, and neon point with the punish, of course, with the Godfist. Didn't Here we reach. go. Oh, good block. Tsunami kick. Oh yes, rape kick, beautiful. Wow, the wake-ups are just chopping away. Yeah, and he is starting to mount this comeback here. Yes. This momentum could help him out in a big way. Oh my okay, gosh, again, electric. part of the interrupting God Fist. Okay, here's the breakfast. Strudel. Yeah. Just enough, able to get the follow-up. Wake-ups again. Oh man, just and I, I like how we sidestep just to get in range for it. Nothing oh my but god. Double perfect, nothing but wake ups, correct decisions from knee. You know, tra trademark Mishima play. Yes. Korean level Mishima play, yes, and it worked out in such a great way. Full Kudos control of his character. Maybe he's still fighting Lily inside. Who yeah, knows? It's going to take a moment. He's thinking about it right now. He wants to adjust. You know, it's not, uh, you know, it's not surprising. Me switching to Devil Jin in itself in a three out of five set, you know, and and Qdan's considering Lily as a counterpick so hard, it took him a game. Let's see if he can make the adjustments here. Yeah, and you know this happened last time. You know, Nee started off with a huge lead when they played mm -hmm. each other in Poland. Yeah, and eventually he switched back, being able to beat his Devil Jin, forcing yes. him to make the switch. Yes. Anyways, here we go. Back into the matchup, and we are in the Mishima building. Someone likes this stage out there. I'm not gonna say. Okay, I here hope we go. Not. Anyways, into the action, starting off. Let's see what happens here. Again, 2-1 in favor of Kudans. Okay. And this is a battle to see who gets into grand finals. Yeah, broken plates everywhere, backing up. Plus frames on the slash kick, pushing him to the wall. Whoa. And it's amazing just seeing the pace that both of these players are playing at. Yes. Okay. The, using the jab, and you know that's a classic with the Mishima play. Using the jab to set up the rest of your offense. Man, Kudans so patient here. Oh, but Nee starting to fight back here, chipping away as well. Shocking. Backing up. Low poke, low poke. Nice. Able to get the low. Goes for the right read wow. there, but able to get anything out of it here. Dang, Man, he's waiting nobody's for this opportunity. The That's the thing, is you flinch, you might die. Yeah. It only okay. takes one little mistake. Look at this. Time again. Oh, oh he got him to duck. That might be it. Oh! Oh, look oh! at that. Is that going to hit? The time is, oh, oh, my gosh. That has an auto block. That's right. And he was able to block it just yes. in time by holding neutral. Flying in the air like that has an auto block to it. And he thought he'd be able to whip punish, but that is not the case. That is Perfect. genius level yes. Devil Jin play here time for Kudos. Killing. Beautiful timer scan there from, by Kudos. The only option he had there was to go low. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Wow, that was sick. Okay. Kudans. 
I didn't even think about it until after yeah, it happened. Right? Man, that was the And look at that. Uh -oh. The momentum now. Kudans had yes. the lead. He missed the combo there, but he gets another opportunity. Double steel pedal. The follow oh, up boy. here. Oh, boy. Wow. Kudans. One round away. One round from beating Ni, nee, who seemingly was unbeatable up until this day. And that's the thing, I think everyone in the loser's bracket don't want to have to deal with Ni nee either. Oh, I know, he's gonna send them down there. Yeah. Okay, okay, be cool. And that's the thing, he already beat Rangchu earlier. Yes. Okay, wake-ups, mix-ups here. Kudans dealing with some offense. Uh-huh, poking away, and here he goes, Ni nee mounting a comeback. Uh oh, but he has his back to the wall. He's gonna have to be careful. Neutral jump, Demon Paw. Yes, and here comes the combo sidewall. Okay, fighting back. Still got the oh red. Oh my gosh, he's still going for it. Oh, choosing not to use the rage drive, and it costs him there. Knee staying alive. Two rounds to one here. We're at the top of the Mishima building. Okay, backing up. And again, only one of these two Mishima stars is gonna be able to take it to the top. Mishima stars. Uh -huh. Wow. Jeez, he got Demon the stone head and the follow-up. Man, he might just tie this game up. Take it a final round. Oh, and the slight whiff, but he was ready. Sidewall. Okay. Wow. Great defense, but this might be a perfect for Nii, and it is. Man, he's he's really collecting them. I think that's the third perfect this set for Nii. Yeah, when he wins, he gets the right reason. He's able to pull it off because it's of his explosive nature with the character. Yeah, he definitely is showing that he is able to carry momentum. Yeah, and but right now, you know, you can never count out Kudans. Kudans is no ready. Way. He's been up two rounds already. He's been waiting for this opportunity, waiting for the right moments. You know, he hasn't been using the health sweep. He hasn't been getting his offense flowing yet. Yeah, it's But it might be time. He does have a huge wow, lead now. look at this lead. Oh, this might oh, be it. One man. more mix-up. So One important. more mix-up here. Perfect! Wow! You know, it, this must be internally for Kudans, must be such a huge accomplishment. He just touched him in the lower abdominal section. Don't know what that's about, but that is a huge accomplishment. I mean, up until today, everyone who's been following the tour has been saying that they have never seen two top-level players play each other in the way that these two did in the past where Ni nee beat down oh, two yeah. dance. Never has it, it was one of those things where he got beat so bad that so we had bad. to look away. Never. I went on my phone. I was like, "What's going on tomorrow?" There has never been a beating like Ni nee gave to Q Dance those two times in a row. And for Q Dance to turn it around here without counterpicking is something that I think is so important to evaluate. That is amazing yeah. that he was able to do that. We Very talked about nice. it last year. He was the only Devil Jin that was able to win. Yes. And even this year, he is proving it again yes. that he is the Devil Jin yes. player. And no character switching. You know, I think Ni nee has popularized that tactic. He's won so many times by switching characters. Yeah. And I think a lot of other players have emulated that because he is truly a god. Well, looking at the